Elizabeth and Henry have just gotten married, so they're going to do all these newly married couple things. Uh, they're going to get their lives set up and organized. They'll eventually settle. Their, well, they'll finish their 10 month long honeymoon, so after the convention, they will Yeah, which is not bad. Um, they will go back to New York. Uh, Elizabeth Kitty Stanton's dad was a judge, and so Henry Stanton will undertake the study of law with her father, and then he'll be, pass the bar, become a lawyer. They'll live in Boston for a little bit of time, um, which is super fun, but they're also having their kids and did all those nice family type things. And then in 1847, one year before a convention, they will be here. They will be in Boston for some place. One of the hardest things we have is trying to... Our neighbor, Marianne McClintock, a friend of hers from Philly, Martha Coffin Wright, and Martha Coffin Wright just happens to have her older sister, Lucretia Mott, in town visiting her as well too. So the four one will gather because Mott's here, she'll tell Jane, hey, you should invite Elizabeth as well. So it's this kind of little thread of different people inviting different people at the same time. July 9th, 1848, the five women will gather for a tea party at Hunt's house. Um, it's meant to be a social event, it's just to get together and talk to old friends and hang out with the celebrity Lucretia Mott. Famously, Elizabeth Cady Stanton will state, state these words, the torrent of my discontent will pour forth with such feminist and indignation that I'll stir the party and myself to do and dare. So she's going to get them ready to go. <laughs>